So we've got five reds, three blues, a sample of three is selected from the bag. So they use the word selected in this question, which is the same as choosing. And here's the key phrase that tells me I'm using the choose button without replacement. So again, I'm using the NCR button. So five red, three blue, I'm choosing three. So part A, I want the probability they're all red, so I'm choosing three, so I want the probability of three reds. So I've got five reds all together, so, so I'm choosing three from those five. So it's five choose three, divided by, and then I've got eight all together, choosing three from eight. Eight choose three. Fraction button, five choose three over eight choose three and that gives me five over twenty-eight part b i want more blue than red selected so how could that happen well if i have three blues and no reds i got more blue than red or if I have two blue and one red, I got more blue than reds, and those are the only two ways in which I can get more blue than red. So working out the first part, probably a three blue first of all. I'm choosing three from three. So it's three choose three out of eight altogether, eight choose three. Calculating that, three, choose three on top, eight, choose three on the bottom, that gives me one over fifty six, and then two blue and one red. So to get two blue, I'm cho choosing two from three. So that's three, choose two. And, so that's times one red, I'm choosing one from five. So that's five, choose one, all over. And choosing three from eight is the total number of combinations of three. So, fraction button. So I've got three, choose two times five choose one and on the bottom eight choose three and that's fifteen over fifty six so there's the two separate calculations and then because I got an or to link them I add them together so the probability of more blue and red is 1 over 56 plus 15 over 56, which is 16 over 56. Okay, that's okay. If I want to just check that's this, to get a fraction in the lowest form, I can just simply type in a fraction in the, on the fraction button. If I press equals, it'll give me the simplest answer, which is 2 sevenths.